turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to go again But you ain't picking your phone up Why What's you messing up? It's your girl right here, Kayla Q Nurse And I'm back! Hey y'all, welcome to the channel All my new subscribers Y'all, I got Look at these nails Y'all, I'm ready for springtime I'm ready Y'all know I can't wear nails long like this But I'm gonna wear them for these couple of days off and let me share in my uh Sephora haul. If y'all got to see that, those little short nubby nails I had, but they was cute. They had little puppy dogs. I don't know if y'all could tell there was little puppy dogs on there, but I had got this kit. Thank you. Shout out to Manology. I put the link below. Y'all look at all these styles. Yes, they come from nail stamping. Okay, it's a stamp for claws, uh, collaborators. Okay, scan the barcode to shop all the stuff for casual collections. They got a lot of different nails, a lot of different nails. And anyway, they reached out to me and I was able to choose three different stamp plates. I had never heard of nail stamping until they reached out. I like them on my little short nubby nails because I still get to have my nails painted and still have them short. I keep mine cut for work purposes. And it's no point in polishing them because it's not much to polish. But anyway, Manology reached out to me and let me choose a couple things. And I've been playing with it for a couple days to kind of get comfortable. And I had my daughter make me some nails. So my youngest daughter's in law school, but she made press-on nails just, I guess, to make extra little money. And, uh, yeah, she got pretty good at These were all white. And I went stamping crazy on them, y'all. I went crazy. They cute. They are really cute. But they sent me over some polishes. And let me just put it down and I'm going to show you guys all the stuff they sent over. Okay, these are the Manology's nail lacquers. And these are, I'm not mistaken, they're stamping lacquers and some real pretty colors. Real pretty. Look at this pink. That's pretty. And then I got an orange. I don't know if it's showing up true to color. And then there's a yellow. Y'all, I love all these colors. A green. I just wanted all spring like colors. They got several, several different kits. A clear. A hot, hot pink. I don't know if y'all can tell. One of these is like a dull pink and one of them is like a hot pink. Y'all, some, some are ready polishes, okay? And then my favorite is this blue. Now, I can wear that just by itself. These nail polishes dry really fast, really fast. And then the stamping plates. I don't know if y'all have ever heard of stamping plates. It was very, very new to me very new to me first let me show y'all this is like a little kit this is the wolf kit and it's for dogs ain't that cute y'all know I love my dog my little Yoshi I love him to death my first only well I have one other dog my husband loved dogs and he bought me Yoshi and I've been had him for almost 15 years now and I just love him to death but anyway you get one of these little scrapers y'all I tried to do some clips I'm going to stick some in here because, y'all, I was straight struggling initially when I was doing my nails. I put it on. I took it off. And I was trying to record it, and it was just, it was looking funny. I started all over. And then today, I went and I did. I said I got a better idea. I want you guys to be able to see it. So I just pulled out those nails she made me, and um, I did the nails I have today. But, yeah, um... And I can't get this out with these nails on. <laughs> ah, it's too funny. In here, you get your stamping. That's your stamper right here. And then this is a black and a white polish. And then you get the, the little puppy dog stamping plate. Let me show it to you guys. I'll show it to you. That comes in here with this and the little scraper to scrape off your plate. And one stamp plate comes in there for one price. Let me get it. 
I'm trying to find the right one. Here is the stamping plate with the puppy dogs. This is what I had on my orange nails. And it says Manology on the back. It's real easy to do. You know, after you play with it for a while, you kind of get it and you, you know, and you just create the designs that you like. And I was just in a spring mood. So thus, this design that I came up with today. Um, you just kind of paint the polish on there and then you scrape it off. It seems and sounds easy, but when you're trying to do your own hands, it is easy. I think I just made it hard. And let me show y'all another plate. This is the one that I did these nails with. It's just like all these four intricate designs. Yeah, that's what I used to create this. And I put like a few of them on top of each other. I like it. I like it. And then another plate I have that I haven't used yet. And these aren't really expensive at all. They're not expensive. This is how the plate comes. This is the next one I want to use on my nails. The stars and the leaves. I want to use those on my nails. My little short nails. Next. I just don't know what color I want to use. But you have to peel this blue film off. And then you paint the square with the polish. And then you come up with your design from there. This is really, really nice. I'll try to put a, a short clip in. And let you guys kind of see how I was doing it somewhere throughout the video okay and then they also sent me this uh, I have bought a bunch of these brushes from Timu so I didn't even open this yet but it's a, a nail brush they have the, the I guess it says a nail artistry tool it's the nail brush with the nail cap can for your new tool will allow you to create years of design cap your unused brush to keep the bristles in quality condition. Okay, so that's just the cap and that's the brush. And it says to keep it cap. But like I said, I didn't even use it. I just used the ones that I ordered from Timo. But I'm sure I will. And the last little thing that came in the, the bundle of stuff they sent over is I didn't use this either. I'm going to tell you, I used the paper towel. But this is so you can grab your cotton when you're doing your nails and you don't mess up your nails because you have to use acetone to clean the plates so you pick up your cotton ball and it'll hold a cotton ball there and you can clean the plate without messing up your nails while you're doing your nails I think this was a genius genius idea yeah yeah okay guys I just really really want to share with you guys and um, I'll just stick a clip in here and just let you guys kind of see some of the portions of what and how I did. Okay guys, this is the stamping plate that I used with the orange nails, with the puppy dolls. The wolf pack is so cute. And then these are the styles that I use for my colorful springtime nails. Um, that's how the stamping plate actually comes initially. Um, I don't think I really used any of these yet no i didn't because i got a plan for the stars on my new nails those stars are going to be really cute and all the plates have manology on the back of them i mean they, they just real neat i think it's really neat um way to get into doing your nails or getting your nails done easily i have that set of nails that my daughter made that were completely white before i kind of you know glued them to my nail pad to go ahead and not really glue them it's some little blue stuff that she showed me to get to stick it to your nail pad and you don't have to do the nails on your hands so yes for my first attempt i think it came really good before you even start using the place though the very first thing you have to do is peel off that little sticker if you don't peel off that sticker uh you trying to stamp for nothing <laughs> it definitely has to come off and it peels off real easy real easy and then after you get that off you can just kind of wipe it off and you're ready to start stamping this bright pink polish is the one that i decided to use there's a bright pink and then there's a kind of muted pink 
So I decided to go with the bright pink because it's so cute. And I just figured it would look good against that white nail polish. So here is the um, Manology kit. This is how it initially comes. This is the one that came with the, the puppy pack. And it's in there really good. That's your stamper. It's I don't know the material, but it's really super soft. And it just picks up the stamps really well. Um, so the first thing you do is get your plate out. And then you're going to pick the design you want, which I'm going to go with that one for the first one. And then I guess I'm just showing you the stamp here. And then you just uh, polish the section that you're going to use for your nail. And you, you're supposed to go quick quickly because the polish dries quickly and uh, you just kind of paint it on onto the plate get it real even and smooth and then you just kind of wipe it off and then you stamp it really fast I'm moving super slow here so yeah stamp it that's what it looks like before you stamp the nail and then you just kind of roll it onto the nail that you're using. And I'm a bit out of frame. Yeah, there we go. Now you just roll it on. And then the design that it picked up, it kind of sticks to the nail. That one didn't come out too well. Again, you have to move fast. The polish dries slow and the polish was kind of dry. So... We're going to try that again. So here with polishing, um, I chose a different uh, design this time. And again, I'm moving really slow. Again, it's just my first time using it. And after a while, oh, I forgot to wipe it off. After a while, or a couple of times, like today, I'm doing my press on nails and yeah, y'all will see them in another video. And oh yeah, you use tape. If you get any mistake or any extra errors, you can use tape. And it'll pick that polish right up off your stamp. It's so super, super easy. It's just a learning curve. See, that one came out perfect because I didn't hesitate. And I went right ahead and did it. So yeah, it came out really good. I went ahead stamping my little heart out and I just started mixing the colors and it's like, you know what? I'm just going to do a rainbow sunny look because I was getting in the groove of it then and I didn't want to go back and take off all of the, the stamps that I had done. So I just kind of started mixing designs and colors and I think it's cute. I could have used like a darker color or something to go in, but yeah. Then I polished them with some gel nail and put them in the lamp. Okay, guys. I hope everybody uh, having a wonderful, blessed day. Enjoyed this video and decide if you decide to get stamping on your nails or put on you some false clear nails and do them how you want to do them or press ons because y'all know I can't wear nails at work. But I'm going to take these off and re-stamp my own nails. I think I'm going to use that all blue. Okay, guys. I will see you in the next video. Y'all stay blessed. And uh, bye, guys. All I want is to go again. But you ain't picking your phone up. Why you messing my head?